1529 forecast. All right, the next big thing I'm tracking from the Weather Center is dogwood winter. Hello, I'm meteorologist Josh Fitzpatrick. Well, what is dogwood winter? Well, a lot of folks call this uh, the, the cold spell when the dogwoods are in full bloom, dogwood winter. A week ago, we had red bud winter when the red buds are in full bloom, and now it's the uh, yeah, the dogwoods there. And thanks to Jim Carpenter for that great snapshot showing the Virginia state flower in all its glory. Uh, we're dealing with temperatures on the cooler side, especially for tomorrow with a cold rain, sleet and snow for some of you. Until then, here's a look outside live in downtown Charlottesville showing a spectacular Sunday, Easter Sunday sunrise coming on up over Pantops Mountain there in the distance. A few high level cirrus clouds making for that nice snapshot first thing this morning in that hour by hour first forecast for today. In in the 50s this morning, going to the low 60s this afternoon with a mostly sunny sky, a couple of uh, high level clouds making for a hazy blue sky with a northeast breeze, and that's a cooler air direction. So we're not going to reach the 70s and 80s until later on in the week. Temperatures right now are in the 40s and the 50s. Not too bad for this time of the year, this time of the morning. Dry scans on NBC 29's live Doppler radar picture. Uh, we're watching a couple of those high level clouds over the Commonwealth, but no precipitation in sight. Some snow clouds over Pennsylvania and the Empire State of New York, a sign of a cooler than average weather pattern for the next couple of days and nights. Watching this growing area of rain, sleet and snow from the mid Mississippi Valley, Missouri Valley, north and west for the uh, northern plain states. This growing area of rain and snow will eventually head our way by this time tomorrow. Let's track it now. High res weather tracker shows those high level clouds at 6 p.m. increasing across our sky, so that will obscure some of our moonlight overnight. Here's dawn into 8 a.m. 24 hours from now, we'll be watching a cold rain overspread the area. If it gets in here fast enough over central Virginia, there could be a few sleet pellets mixed in, but it's mainly over the Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah Valley, late morning, midday. You're most favored to see a little wintry precipitation and then over the higher elevations of the Blue Ridge. You may get briefly a little coat of some uh, sleet and snow over the grassy areas, elevated surfaces, but the roadways will be on the wet side and it's rain area wide later tomorrow here 6 p.m. Widespread rain up to a half inch or so of rainfall is projected after tomorrow's rain. That is it for perhaps at least a week followed by a big time warm up. Look at this highs highs tomorrow in the 40s a week from today in Charlottesville and may get close to 90 degrees for the, uh, for the first time of the season. A wild roller coaster ride in temperatures over the next week or so. All right, so your forecast on this Easter Sunday daytime highs in the upper 50s, low 60s. Our average high now is 70 for this time of the year. Mostly 50s and 60s today under a mostly sunny sky and dry skies through tonight with lows in the 30s and 40s. Maybe some freezing temperatures across the valley. Uh, watch those uh, tender plants and those blooms, the flowers, protect them for sure. Highest tomorrow in the 40s, barely out of the 30s for the valley with a wintry mix changing over to a cold rain area wide in the afternoon. Seven day forecast, the rain is gone tomorrow night. Maybe some patchy frost if it gets out of here fast enough under a clearing sky in the 30s. 50s on Tuesday, more frost more likely I think on Wednesday morning and then highs in the 50s and 60s on Wednesday, low 70s Thursday and then it's back to summer. Good good time for the start of um, next weekend in the 80s. Uh, Friday after Friday looks to be on the warm side also for Earth Day on Friday. But again, a week from today, it might reach 90 degrees. So wow, a lot of weather over the next seven days, but no severe weather expected. All right, a lot of weather to look out for mm -hmm. and also looking out for us today on this Easter Sunday. A lot of people love Easter candy. Oh, yes. Are you a big Easter candy? I'm thinking peeps. Oh, yeah. Cadbury eggs. Mm -hmm. What are what's your favorite? I like the 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 Reese cups. That's that's my downfall. The ones that are the, shaped the, the like eggs. eggs. Yeah, there, there's something about those that I think are better than the original, mm -hmm. actually, because I think they're thicker. There's a lot more peanut butter in it. All right. <laughs> you keep track of it. You keep track of it. <laughs> yes. I'm weighing them out. You're weighing them out. <laughs> Taste test. That is too funny. Well, you may be familiar.